Hi everyone, my name is Vikas Raut. Welcome to my channel Digital Prime. Friends, in today's video, I'm going to show you how you can make the changes of themes in SAP application. So, let me log in into SAP application. And there I'll show you how we can make the changes of themes over there itself. Well, now you can see that I have given the user ID and password. Now it is taking somewhat time to log in into the server. Now you can see that we have logged in into the server itself. So what I'll do is I'll double click on SAP login pad. And again, I have to provide my, you know, user ID and password. So just observe the screen, the entire look and feel of this you know the pop-up menu which has appeared on the screen as of now so it is showing in this way okay and it is you know you can see that it's as for uh, 2022 so let's double click on it and just observe you know the entire screen how it is really looking okay and once we make the changes of themes then definitely there will be slight changes on the entire uh, user interface okay so let's uh, give the user id and password once again and uh, you know uh, get into the sap application easy access screen so you can see this is the easy access screen uh, which is you know appearing in such a way so you just keep on observing the entire screen as of now uh, because the moment we will make the changes of themes, the entire look and feel of this SAP Easy Access screen and the login process will completely change. The process will be completely same, but the look and feel will be completely different. So how to make the changes? Just click on this more, you know, option and you can find out SAP GUI settings and actions. Then you have options. Just click on option. Uh, under visual design you can see theme settings okay as of now we are in quads theme right so just click on drop down you can use any of these but you know the standard one the previous one which i was using is sap signature theme so i'm just selecting that and click on apply and click on ok and what you do is just come out of the easy access screen in order to come out the easy access screen just press forward slash N E X and press enter so you have just logged out and just once again you know close this uh, pop-up as well just a refresh once again and just double click once again on the SAP login you know icon so now you just observe how you know the GUI the entire look and feel will look like now you can see the there is a changes the changes have took place and the look and feel was completely changed right now so just double click on this sap s4 2022 and uh, you know give your user id and password once again and you can see right now how the entire screen is looking like okay and just click on uh, just uh, press enter and you can see the sap easy access screen is completely changed so this is how, uh, you know, we can make the changes of our SAP screen theme. And, you know, in order to go back to the same screen, what we can do is we have to follow the same process. But, you know, over here, what you have to do is in this screen is you have to click on this customize local layout icon. And then you will find out option. And, you know, under visual design, you have theme settings. And again, select themes from the drop down. What you can do is you can select the previous one, which was quads theme, which we were using earlier and just select it out. Click on apply, click on OK. And similarly, just go out of the screen once again. OK, just forward slash and EX press enter and close this, you know, application once again and just re login once again, you will find out. Yes, we are back on the same screen which we were using previously. So this is how the process is making a changes into the themes of SAP easy access screen. So this is the way which we can use it out in order to make a changes. So you can see that. Yes, we are back to the same theme. 
which we were using it out earlier okay i hope you have uh, you might have liked this video and if you wanted to give any suggestion if you wanted to you know have a question if you have any question you can comment in the comment section definitely i will like to entertain those uh, questions whichever you are asking from me thank you so much for your time for watching this video thanks a lot